Happy, happy Wednesday, everybody. So today I wanted to talk a little bit about your why. So we've talked before in the past about the importance of having a strong why to get you through those times that maybe you don't want to get up, maybe you don't want to get that workout in, or maybe you're just like, I want to cave and I just want to eat whatever I want. So having a really strong why is going to be paramount to your results, to pushing you through those hard times because there's going to be hard times, guys. And, you know, like I've been completely honest with you guys, I've really been struggling the past few weeks, you know, shoulder injury, I just went to PT, which I'm just like, you're not giving me the answers I want, I just want to get better now. Um, you know, I've been having back issues I haven't really shared. Um, and so it's really easy for me to find reasons why not to get up, you know, like I don't want to hurt my back more, I don't want to hurt my shoulder more, but I can absolutely still do the moves, I just might have to modify a little bit. And that's one great thing about all the workouts is they all come with a modifier. So if you really listen, you can hear, don't drop so low, drop those waists if, it, if it's too hard. Um, maybe slow down and, and really listen to those visual or those audible cues, like, you know, talking about how important it is to engage your core, um, how important it is to kind of, when you're doing squats, to put the weights towards your heels. So what I always like to do is try to lift my toes up a little bit. And so then that way you're, you're leaning back into the squat. You're not putting your knees over your toes. But one thing that I really want to share that's really, really helped me kind of push through, like when I'm in the workout and I don't want to do it or I want to give up, or I'm just like those negative beliefs, those negative self talks, that doubt come in what I go to that really helps me. So I'm gonna take you guys on a tour. <laughs> so you guys all know that we work out in our gym every single day. And I have, I have a vision board. And when times get tough, this is what I look at. And you know, I tell myself, you know, this has like my goals in life, in um, my relationships and my friendships, in just what I want, you know, um, business wise, as well as just relationship wise. So. I always look at this, I'm like, believe, believe you can, believe you can, you know? And then I, I hope to inspire change in some of you. I hope to love on you. I love is a verb, it's action. So action, laugh every day, you know, things like that. So, um, and then I always look, this is an older one, this is from like last year, but this one I always look at too, um, because I have a strong faith and sometimes that's the only thing that gets me through. Um, times I want to give up, I just want to quit, but I look at that and I'm like, you can do it, you can do it. So my challenge for you guys today, and since today is the last day um, that I'm going to give a challenge, I'm going to make this challenge worth 20 points because it does take time and you have to make the time. And I know we all have crazy schedules. So for those of you that do it, I want to reward you with 20 points. What I want you guys to do is create a vision board. And I heard from my very favorite, favorite book called You're a Badass by Jen Sincero. She calls it a craft date with God. And I love that because you're just kind of putting out into the universe. You're focusing on, on all the good. You're focusing on what you wanna bring into your life. You're focusing on what is important to you. So when those times come, and they are gonna come, guys, you have something to reflect on, to look at, to focus on, to have purpose for. So I challenge you guys all to have your little craft date with God today. Um, we will be announcing um, the, cha the challenges I've given so far. I will be announcing the winner tomorrow afternoon. So you guys have until, I'm gonna, I'll give you guys a time so it helps. So tomorrow is church group. So tomorrow at 6 p.m. Um, all the challenges need to be done by tomorrow at 6 p.m. And I will be announcing the winner at that time. So today's challenge for 20 points is to create a vision board of what you want of life, business, relationships with God, um, in your health and fitness journey, whatever that is. And I would love for you to take a picture and post it below. So I hope you guys have a fabulous, fabulous day. As Justin would say, eat well, and we will talk soon. Bye everybody.